Hello everyone, Hells here, and we're going to be taking another shot at the egg trial, this time with our second team. So we have CG Fina up, she's going to be our healer. She's geared mostly for health, spirit, and earth resist. She's got a whole 80 earth resist. Hopefully that's enough. CG Lid's going to be our breaker. She's geared 250% high tide and 11 passive limit crystal fill per turn. And that's because she has Titan as an Esper instead of Carbuncle. That way she has at least 50% earth resist without changing out her gear. Mercenary Ramsey is going to be our melee cover. He is geared 100% of aid. And he's also geared to have good health, spirit, and decent amount of earth resist. Randy is going to be the damage dealer this time. He's geared to have 100 earth resist and just maximize damage as much as possible. I do have the vest on him from doing the easier versions of the trial. And he's got stone killer and golem underneath. Uriah is going to be our buffer. She's going to buff up earth resist and stats and have fun with the nice barriers. She's geared to have some limit fill, some high tide and just a decent amount of health and spirit. And then I don't have any Randy friends showing up at the moment, so we're going to have an Estabaro, and this because they can chain together at least. And this one isn't set up for the trial, but it should hopefully be good enough. She has 50 earth in her kit and lightning weapon. So here's the Espers and the team that we're going to go in with second. So let's see how they can do. Okay. So let's see. Alright, so we're going to use her cooldown, that way we should get everybody healed and a re-raise on everybody. Mercenary Ramza. We're going to put up melee cover. Seeing they were kind enough to give me a limit burst, Lid can use her good break. And again, seeing the limit burst is there, might as well. That way we'll get a barrier in the high percentage buffs. And we can just chain their limits together and see how much damage they do. Anytime Ramza wants to finish countering.
Hey, he's done. Okay, so this turn, Urash is going to give us Earth Buff. And then we'll do General Mitigation. Breaks is still good, Lid can do her invent. And throw that out, I guess. Ramza will use provoke this turn. Randy will triple cast lightning attack, and this time Esther will do lightning debuff. So this won't be a good chain, but it'll be a nice setup turn. Alright, so this time 80% he should buff himself. He didn't buff himself. Interesting. Alright, whenever you're done, Ramza. Alright, so... Her limit's back up. We're just gonna go with the high breaks from Lid. Still got one turn on re-raise. I'll just toss out a small heal air. Should be fine there. I still got a turn on the good buff, so what we'll do is magic mitigation. I'll toss out the high general mitigation. This turn we'll do a limit burst chaining. Because they both should have lightning element now, and he should debuff lightning. Yeah, I would say so. Yeah, we'll just refresh his melee cover. That way he can do something later if need be. Yeah, there's the buff. Okay, that was painful. Alright, 
So what we're going to do, we're going to jam impulse. That way I don't remove any of the good stuff that I have on them. Urash is going to limit burst and fill up there. Prime heal. Didn't a hundred percent fill everybody, but I guess that's okay. I got two turns before I can do anything really. So we'll let them guard, I guess. He does have provoke still. So let's trust her. One turn on reduce magic and one on reduce regular. All right, we're gonna have to break again. And I think we have to provoke. So yeah, cover is up, so we will use his provoke. We're going to give Earth buff. And I do have that up, so we're going to use this. No, actually, we'll put up the magic one. I don't need to heal, really. So we'll get re-raise on everybody with Fiona's limit. this as a prep turn. So you had a lightning weapon anyway, right? Yeah, okay. So I just prep them. And I guess we're going to use her cooldown. Because limit's not ready yet. Those are nice counters.
Alright, let's see what we got for buffs. Alright, magic's good, re-raise is good, he needs cover. So a general mitigation would be good. And I guess I can do that with it, because she doesn't have anything else to do really at the moment. Breaks are good there. As far as damage goes, we're just going to triple cast lightning. And she's going to do bolting. This way we'll get the one missing Esper achievement Team 1 didn't get. Yeah. See how much damage they can do? Just triple cast it. Alright, so we hit the 4% lock. He's got all brakes on. Say, so what did she unlock? Oh, full heal. So we can take a gamble with this, and it wasn't magic. Oh well. Yeah, how much damage are you gonna spit out? You gonna kill it? We're counting. You are. Eh, that works. You was gonna get a limit burst chain next turn anyway. Alright, it's team two. We got the missing S Revoke. And now we're up to ten units. So, next video will be team three. Hopefully, a full set of five different units. So, you can look forward to that.